like to introduce uh, another clip from the October 14, 2019 Supervisors Meeting. This particular clip uh, comes at the near the end of a discussion about noise. Two neighbors uh, have a conflict about noise and the kids driving uh, two-stroke dirt bike engines near one, one home. So this particular clip uh, highlights uh, Mr. Jeffrey Anderton and his attempt to get to the solution by what I recognize as essentially browbeating one of the people who came in to complain about the noise. So uh, when you watch the complete episode uh, related to this noise ordinance discussion, you will come to the, I hope come to the, some of the conclusions I have where they're essentially trying to recreate the wheel. There are thousands, if not hundreds of thousands of communities in the United States that have had to deal with noise ordinance. It's not something new. Uh, this particular uh, issue has been around for a long time. But uh, what I'm trying to highlight here is the way that Mr. Anderton essentially attacks uh, people that come to the meeting with, with concerns or issues. Uh, so watch this and then watch when I post the full meeting for the complete discussion on the noise ordinance. It is a rather lengthy part of the meeting that was held on October 14th, 2019. affecting everybody, not just <clears throat> one family, two families. Could, could you expand on the thing you said about the muffler being muffled? <laughs> <laughs> well, there's like a stuffing you can put in. Like we even use it when we go trail riding for spark arresters and stuff. And it just brings down the decibels a little bit type of thing. Is that a, has that been discussed between you guys at all? Or is, is that an option? Or? So I would be considered to do Okay. That. This is about the noise, correct? It's, yeah. it's not, I think this is going to... No, I'm saying if we, if they use something to, to bring down the noise, is that, would that maybe help? So again, this is kind of getting, so we actually have a decibel meter, so regardless of what somebody tells us to look at on the internet, we can tell you how many decibels. No, I'm not, I, maybe I didn't make myself clear. So no, if I they lowered the decibel level of the motorcycles, would that help you guys with your, the issues you're having with the noise? They already say it's low enough to begin with. But let, let's just say they made it lower. Would that help? Like they, it wasn't as loud. It lowered the decibel level. I understand what the, the meaning of the word lower is. I guess what I'm saying is it depends on how many decibels. And yeah. the reason why everybody has noise ordinances is because there's a certain what's considered noise above a certain level of right. decibels. So I. Well, that's what I, that's you, you're you're literally saying what I'm I'm trying to say to you. If if that if that level came down to an acceptable, well, I don't either. But I'm just saying, is I, we're we're trying to, to talk and, and see if maybe there's something we could do without you know because people have concerns about spending all this money, and now obviously weed whackers are affected, leaf blowers, the farmer gentleman who uses his you know stuff to, to work. If if the level came down. Would you guys be okay if it came down to a low enough level? Would you be okay with it? Or are you are you looking to just have no motorcycles running at all? I don't agree that weed whackers and everything are because again, if you had, if you're if you're in our yard and you have a, a leaf blower, a lawn mower, it is it is not. It, it doesn't matter what somebody if somebody tells me it's not the number of decibels it is, it still is because I have me. We're, we're not saying. They're saying it's at certain decibel. Now we're saying if it could get lowered down, would that be an op okay? So, so taking, so taking <laughs> your measurement, <laughs> I don't. If, it, if it's 70, if it's 90, whatever it is, if it's look, you know, say your decibel meter says it's 90, if we could get it to an acceptable level or 60, right. is that okay? If they muffled the bikes, would you guys be okay with it, or do you just not want them riding at all? So back to the noise. Well, that, that's what we're saying. If if it if it wasn't as loud as it was, would you be okay with it? 
Isn't that where we well, it's a tough thing to regulate because when you when you set a noise ordinance, it's not just like okay, those kids aren't riding those bikes next to our house anymore. It, it affects other residents who don't have people complaining. It affects weed whackers. It affects farmers. It affects leaf blowers. So we're trying to figure out if we can maybe do something. I guess that would be more. Um, feasible for the whole township as, as opposed to like one group trying to shut down another group like we're just trying to see if maybe there's something we can do with this general that does that make sense or no 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 good so there's going to be two ordinances one we're really concerned about the overall noise ordinance and that's mainly what the professional services are for I mean, so this one's more separate from that property. So, the, so you're going to be doing it throughout the whole township then and not just at that one spot to make a... That is correct. This would be a township.